Ever pondered over the issue of escalating food demand and the strain it puts on our world's resources? As we move deeper into the 21st century, the planet's population continues to surge at an unprecedented pace. With every passing second, more mouths are joining the global dinner table, each with their own unique set of dietary needs and desires. This escalating demand for food is creating a pressure cooker scenario where the heat is constantly turned up on our world's resources. To feed this growing populace, we're striving to maximize agricultural output, but this increased production doesn't come without its costs. We're draining our water reserves at an alarming rate, with agriculture consuming about 70% of our global freshwater supply. And let's not forget about land. Fertile, arable land is becoming a scarce commodity. As our cities expand, the countryside shrinks, leading to a steady erosion of our agricultural base. This isn't just a problem for farmers, it's a problem for all of us. Then there's the environmental toll. Intensive farming practices lead to soil degradation, deforestation, and loss of biodiversity. As we strive to grow more, we're damaging the very ecosystems that support us. We're caught in a seemingly endless cycle of demand and supply, where the scale is tipping ever more precariously towards the demand side. The situation is complex and fraught with challenges, but that doesn't mean it's insurmountable. As we've done throughout history, we can innovate, adapt, and find solutions to our most pressing problems. And perhaps, just perhaps, the answer to this food supply conundrum doesn't lie in the skies above or the seas below, but right beneath our feet. Maybe the solution is as simple and as complex as the dirt we walk on every day. So, how can we tackle this ever-growing problem? Perhaps the answer lies beneath our feet in the soil itself. Enter the world of electronic soil a technological innovation that might change the face of agriculture. This isn't your grandmother's gardening secret or an old farmer's tall tale. No, this is the cutting edge of agricultural technology, a blend of nature and silicon that could very well revolutionize how we grow our food. So, what is electronic soil? At its core, it's a high-tech approach to understanding and optimizing the environment in which plants grow. Think of it as a smart ground a soil infused with sensors and microprocessors that can monitor and adjust conditions to favor plant growth. It's like having a team of microscopic gardeners working around the clock to ensure your plants have the perfect conditions to thrive. These sensors don't just sit idle, they continuously collect data about the soil's conditions. Everything from temperature and moisture levels to the concentration of various nutrients is monitored in real time. This data is then processed and analyzed to make smart decisions about what the plants need at any given moment. But the real magic happens when the electronic soil interacts with the plant roots. It's able to communicate with the roots, understanding their needs and responding accordingly. If the roots need more moisture, the soil can trigger a watering system. If they're lacking a certain nutrient, the soil can release it from a built-in reservoir. It's a dynamic, interactive relationship between the soil and the plants, all aimed at optimizing growth. This is not just a passive, one-way street. The electronic soil can learn from the plants, adjusting its behavior based on what works best. Over time, it can even develop a sort of growth profile for each plant, understanding its unique needs and preferences. It's a symbiotic relationship that has the potential to increase yields and make our agriculture more sustainable. Intriguing, isn't it? Let's delve a bit deeper into how this sci-fi sounding technology actually functions. How does this electronic soil work, you ask? Well, let's delve into the intricate workings of this technological marvel. At the heart of electronic soil is a network of tiny sensors. These microscopic workhorses are embedded within the soil and serve as the eyes and ears of the system. They continuously monitor a myriad of soil parameters, temperature, moisture, pH levels, nutrient content, and more. Each detail is critical, painting a comprehensive picture of the soil's health and the conditions within it, but monitoring alone isn't enough. The data collected by these sensors are fed into a sophisticated analytical system. This is where the magic happens. The system crunches the numbers, drawing on complex algorithms to interpret the data and make sense of what's happening beneath the surface. It's like having a team of expert agronomists examining your soil around the clock. Once the system has a firm grasp of the soil's condition, it gets to work. Depending on the data, it can adjust the soil conditions to create an optimal environment for plant growth. Need more moisture? The system triggers irrigation. Too acidic? It can balance the pH by releasing alkaline substances. Nutrient deficient? No problem, it can supplement with the necessary nutrients. 
This is all done autonomously without any human intervention. The system learns from the data, adjusting and refining its responses to ensure the best possible conditions for plant growth. It's a dynamic, responsive system that adapts to the ever-changing needs of the plants. But it's not just about immediate adjustments. The system also collects and stores data over time, learning from past patterns and predicting future needs. This predictive ability allows it to preemptively address potential issues, ensuring that the soil is always in peak condition. In essence, electronic soil is a smart, self-regulating system that takes the guesswork out of agriculture. It leverages the power of technology to create the perfect environment for plants, optimizing growth and maximizing yield. Now that we've grasped the working of electronic soil, let's explore its potential in solving our food demand problem. Can electronic soil really be the solution to the global food demand problem? Now that's a question that's been on the minds of many. As we delve deeper into this, we see a future where agriculture could be revolutionized by this technology. Imagine a world where farmers can optimize the conditions for plant growth at the touch of a button. Electronic soil, with its sensors and artificial intelligence, has the potential to do just that. It can monitor and adjust the levels of nutrients, moisture, and pH in the soil, creating the perfect environment for each plant. The result? A significant increase in agricultural productivity. This technology could also lead to a drastic reduction in the wastage of resources. Traditional farming methods often involve excessive use of water and fertilizers, much of which is lost due to inefficient distribution. Electronic soil, on the other hand, can deliver these resources directly to the roots of the plants, where they are most needed. This not only conserves resources but also reduces the environmental impact of farming. But the potential of electronic soil goes even further. Consider areas where the soil conditions are poor or even non-existent. Yes, we're talking about deserts, rocky terrains, and even other planets. Electronic soil could make it possible to grow food in these places. Imagine turning barren lands into lush, productive farms or even growing food on Mars. The implications for food security and the fight against hunger are immense. So can electronic soil really be the solution to the global food demand problem? Well, the potential is certainly there. It could increase productivity, reduce wastage, and expand the areas where we can grow food. But, like any new technology, it comes with its own set of challenges. Is it all rosy? The potential seems immense, but is it all rosy? Let's take a look at the challenges that lie ahead. While electronic soil promises a lot, the path to its wide adoption isn't without challenges. The promise of electronic soil is immense. Yet, like any new technology, it faces a number of hurdles. One of the most significant of these is cost. The technology that powers electronic soil is cutting edge and, as a result, currently quite expensive. This makes it inaccessible to many farmers, particularly those in developing countries, who might benefit most from its implementation. Then there's the technical complexity. Electronic soil is not a plug-and-play solution. It requires a deep understanding of both technology and agriculture. Farmers need to be trained to manage and troubleshoot these systems, and this can be a daunting task. This leads to another challenge, acceptance by the farming community. For centuries, farming has been about hands-on, tangible work with the land. Convincing farmers to trust a technology that they cannot see or touch is a significant hurdle, but it's not all doom and gloom. Despite these challenges, the future of electronic soil is bright. Researchers are tirelessly working to make the technology more affordable and user-friendly. Innovative solutions are being developed to simplify its deployment and management, and efforts are being made to educate farmers about the benefits of this technology to ease their apprehensions. Moreover, the possibilities that electronic soil opens up are truly exciting. Imagine a world where crops can be grown in any condition, where food scarcity is a thing of the past. Imagine the environmental benefits, with less water and fewer chemicals needed. Imagine the boost to economies, with increased crop yields and healthier produce. The potential of electronic soil to transform agriculture is immense. It's a technology that has the capability to quite literally feed the world. And while there are challenges to be overcome, the potential rewards are well worth the effort. Electronic soil, a technological marvel, holds the potential to revolutionize agriculture and help us keep pace with the growing food demand. Yet, like every innovation, it has its own set of challenges to overcome. The road ahead is certainly interesting.